Hey guys, we are down here at Santee Cooper. We've got Matt Outlaw. He is the outlaw behind our outlaw net. Uh, it's Matthew Outlaw Signature Series. We're about to go put that baby to work. How are we gonna do it today, man? It's gonna be on um, slow trolling over top of brush. Pretty simple. Okay, slow trolling over. Uh, what are we gonna catch today? Uh, whites, blacks? You probably catch mostly blacks. Mostly might, black. You might catch a white, but 90% is gonna be black. All right, what kind of hammers are we gonna be looking for today? Um, anything over a pound and a half. Anything over a pound and a half? Yeah. I'll tell you what, I don't know if I've caught uh, but one black fish over a pound and a half. Well, you gonna get them today. We gonna get them today. Guys, stay tuned. We're getting ready to get out of here. We're gonna hit some brush down here on Santa Cooper. Try to get on some of them big old black fish. Please subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. We appreciate it, guys. Let's get to it. Old man said he's gonna put us on him by God, I think he has. Look at them cowboys right there, guys. Big old pretty, pretty black fish. I mean nice black fish right there, boy. Santee Cooper. We're gonna put these back. I think anyway. Hey, no. No? Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> I just throw that dude back. I have some in the freezer. Well, it's South Carolina, but we got to survive out here. <laughs> <laughs> I think that qualifies as a party fail there, guys. I, I was thinking we throw them back. When did we ever agree to that? <laughs> I'm gonna show y'all what we're fishing here this morning. Old Mastodon went and put us on some, as y'all just saw. Right there it is on the live scope. Got your brush pile. Got crappie loaded up on top of it. There you go. So that's what we're doing. We're uh, spider rigging. We're coming up on it, and we just kind of hovered there on it. We're getting ready to get back in there. Another nice little black fish. All right, right here's what's going on, guys. You can see the brush pile and the fish. Get some crappie in here. See them big old dudes right there? What do you think? Them are? Well, they fish themselves. All right. Uh, primarily, we got a uh, black crappie here. There's, there's a lot of white. We probably kept ninety percent black today. Okay. Now. These black crappie, they're going to bite just a little bit different, ain't they? Well, especially this morning, you'll see a lot of times you'll see your pole bounce a little bit. You, know, you just got to let them, let them hit it and load up on it before you set the hook. Okay, so I'm, look, I'm looking for the pole to actually bend down, not just the little kick. You want to see them load up. A lot of times that little kick, is, the fish will be running and he'll be looking at your minnow, and your minnow gets scared. And sometimes he'll hit it and just bite bite on the minnow's tail, but you want to actually see him load up on the, on the pole. Okay. The hook. Okay, and we are keeping fish today, right? We are. <laughs> yeah, y'all saw me throw one back there a minute ago. Uh, I, I shouldn't have. That, that was good fish. It was a over pound black crappie. And I'm telling you what, guys, black crappie are 
my favorite fish because them dudes hit like they're mad. I mean, they hit like a derailed train most of the time when they hit. Uh, but yeah, we are live scoping here this morning, uh, live scoping a brush pile. And uh, Matt was gracious enough to bring me out here on Santee. Uh, what we're using this morning, we've got uh, Rockport Rattlers. That one right there, he's tipping with a minnow. And then the other poles, we've each got one minnow pole uh, rigged up. And then the other ones, as you can see, we got the uppercuts. Uh, got the uppercuts on there, got those tipped with a minnow. Uh, they do have a quarter ounce split shot. What is that, a number four split shot? Something like that. N number four, number five split shot up above it. Sorry, guys, just missed one there. I looked up and my line was sideways. Uh, I don't care where you're at. If your line goes sideways, set the hook. Uh, or at least try to. I just missed that one. But we're going to get back in here, try to put some fish in the boat. And uh, we are down on Santee Cooper. Uh, what's the limit down here? 20 per person. Uh, what's the size minimum? 8 inches. 8 inch minimum. Now, you ain't going to see us catch, uh, keep no 8 inch fish, but they get up our good eating size, good pan size. We're going to stick them in the boat. Let's get in there and uh, see what we can do. Remember, if you have not subscribed, please do so. Give us a thumbs up. We appreciate it, guys. That's what I'm talking about right there, baby. That's what I come to South Carolina for. Old Matt has put us on them this morning. Pow! Love it. Crappie monster has hit Santee, baby. Look what a pig that dude right there is. What color was that on? Chicken pox. Chicken pox small fry. Pow. My God, what a black fish. What we're doing here, guys, Matt is taking us from waypoint to waypoint at a little bit quicker uh, speed so we can get up there and then uh, all we're doing is just kind of hovering over them, just kind of trying to set steel right on top of those brush piles these fish uh down here south carolina the water's a lot warmer than what it is up in kentucky they're already uh setting up is this what you would call a summertime pattern for down here yep they're already getting set up in the summertime pattern i don't even know what today is april something april 9th 10th may. or uh may 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 10th may 11th somewhere in there and they're already on a summertime pattern down here so we're gonna creep up on this one. We're gonna creep up on it pretty slow. We're gonna watch it with the live scope. And I'll try to get you some footage here of what it looks like when we first come up to it. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Right there it is, guys. Right there's one. There's some on the other side, some more up in it. There's liable to be a couple real nets. Uh, yeah, there was a good knot right there on the side of it. Now we're gonna get in there and see if we can't catch one of them. Catch the fish, I'll stick them in the live wheel, 
Biden. Ain't Biden. Good eating size fish. on the phone, I'm gonna catch these fish. <laughs> hey guys, I'm gonna show you what we got going on here. We're getting ready to pull up to this right here and see if we can't catch some fish off of it. Right there it is. 10 feet out. We're fishing five to seven foot deep. There's an awful lot of fish in there and some really good ones. That's what she looks like. Got our spider rig set up here. We are fishing three poles a piece. We're using a rock pup port rattler quarter ounce head. Eighth ounce head. Eight, eighth ounce head. I'm sorry, they look a little bigger where they got the beads in them. Eighth ounce heads, no split shot, tied straight to the line, tipping with uh, the crappie monster uh, chicken pox small fry and a minnow. And we've got one rod left that's straight minnow, and that's the only one left, I think, ain't it? The rest of them are all the small fries. Those are available at crappiemonster.com. That dude right there, the outlaw net. That's also uh, available at crappiemonster.com. It's Matt Outlaw Signature Series. Uh, we teamed up on it. And the way everything's going, I believe we have uh, knocked a home run with it. Came back to the same brush pile that we fished this morning this morning the fish were a little bit lower and now that the sun's come up so have the fish they were a lot closer to the top another very nice black crappie Putting that outlaw net to work. Pow. 
all, baby. I'm telling you. I'll tell you what, guys, this right here is. This right here is fun. That right there is what did I come all the way down here for. Very nice fish. There we go, baby. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Now guys, I have busted my personal best black crappie about eight times here today already. Up Kentucky at the lake that we fish, we don't get a whole lot of these cowboys like this one. They right there is nice. Having an awesome time. Awesome time. That's all I can say. Show you what it looks like right here. We got the 360. Let's see, where's where's our brush pile at? All right, it's right there. It's over to our left. I'm trying to that white that white spot right there. Yeah, you all can see right there is our brush pile. And right there is what it looks like. I don't know what that is, but it ain't a crappie. But we got plenty of them in there. When they're out that far, we're 30 to 35 foot out. See how they're vertical bars instead of the instead of being the traditional blob that you see, like when you go in the 20 foot. When you get out that far, they're vertical bars. Right there they are. You keep rubbing on my leg. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to get to the screen, man. So I wanted to show you what we was getting ready to do. We're getting ready to slide up here and see if we can't catch some. I'm sure he'll end up catching them. He keeps on putting my poles off the brush pile. <laughs> Let's see. I'll edit that up. Pretty fish right there. I mean, pretty bull. Nope. 
am I? I ain't no crappie, it's a tarpon. Doggone tarpon, smallmouth bass. You see a thing jumping? Some bitches in the trolling. No, that's good fish. Good fish. Guys, speed over. Oh! Net. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Show, oh, that's a good fish. Show, oh, that's a good fish. God, dog. Oh. That's what I'm talking about right there. I don't know where mine went to. Heard a splash. Did it bounce out? I hope not. No, it didn't. Surely it didn't. I hope it didn't. Where's my rod? There's my rod. There's my line. There's my jig hit. There's the fish. He's back here in the doggone trash bucket. Oh, calm down, baby. Calm down. It ain't so bad. I was getting ready to say before he uh, pulled this great big old sow in here. Speed is not really uh, an issue or any part of what we're doing. We pulled up to the brush pile, like that I told you, and we just kind of hovered, just trying to hold steel. That's all it is. And bam, that's a real good fish, but man, he looks little next to that dude. Guys, if y'all haven't already, please subscribe, give us a like, we appreciate it. Stay tuned for uh, some more videos coming your way from right down here on Santee Cooper with uh, Mr. Outlaw right there, guys. We'll see you.